Smile is a great horror movie and is showing in theaters around you, so I would be summarizing the movie in this video please enjoy, please subscribe, like, and check my page for more amazing contents. At the point when the loathsomeness accounts of the 2010s are composed, the 10 years will be related with injury illustrations how the 80s are with slasher motion pictures. Furthermore, in spite of the fact that it comes on the cusp of another 10 years, the new foremost wide discharge blood and gore flick, Grin, fits right in with its PTSD-prompted family. The distinction here is that the beast is scarcely a similitude by any means, the devil, or detestable soul, or anything it is, the film is unclear on this point, in a real sense benefits from. And is spread by, injury, in particular, the ambiguous something that canine's doctor Rose Cotter, Sozy Bacon, all through Grin, prefers the flavor of individuals who have seen another person passing on by self-destruction, grisly, difficult, horrendous self-destruction, by garden shears and approaching trains and the broke parts of a clay container in a clinic consumption room. That is where Rose momentarily meets Laura, Caitlin Stacy, a PhD understudy who's brought to the mental crisis ward where Rose works. Shaking and panic that something is on a mission to get her. It seems as though individuals, however it's anything but an individual, Laura makes sense of, saying that this thing has been following her since she saw one of her teachers pummeling himself to death with a mallet four days sooner. Toward the finish of the lengthy discourse scene that opens the film, Laura goes to Rose with an insane smile all over and continues to cut her own throat. This would disrupt anybody, yet it particularly annoys Rose given that Rose's own mom kicked the bucket by self-destruction numerous years sooner. That waiting injury, and the feelings of dread and disgrace that encompass it, structure the film's most smart topical string, Rose's life partner Trevor, Jesse T. Usher, concedes that he's investigated acquired psychological maladjustment on the web, and unforgiving terms like screwballs, crackpots, and head cases, are utilized to portray insane individuals all through the film. The possibility that she could not really be tormented by the very substance that killed Laura, and that her mind flights, lost time, and close-to-home instability could have an inner reason, appears to irritate Rose more than the idea of being reviled. Individuals around Rose, including Trevor, her specialist drive Northcott, Robin Weigert, her supervisor Dr. Desai, Cal Penn, and her sister Holly, Jillian Zinzer, absolutely assume the issue is more neurochemical than otherworldly, that is. Until it's past the point of no return, the one in particular who accepts Rose is her ex, Joel, Kyle Gallner, a cop who's been relegated to Laura's case. Their conditional get-together makes the way for the film's secret component, which makes up a lot of Grin's long, however not excessively lengthy, 115-minute runtime. The film's storyline follows a significant number of your commonplace beats of a powerful frightfulness secret, raising from a speedy Google, modern times likeness a run-of-the-mill library scene, to an in-person interview with a damaged Detained overcomer of anything that this noxious substance really is. Brief reference is made to a group of comparable occasions in Brazil, opening up the way to a continuation. Grin's most noteworthy resource is its determined, harsh terribleness. Here youngsters and pets are all around as helpless as grown-ups, and the loathsomeness components are horrendous and upsetting to match the dim subjects. This unsparing reasonableness is upgraded by Bacon's unstable, weak execution as Rose. At a certain point, she shouts at Trevor, I'm not insane, then murmurs a statement of regret and peers down at her shoes in disgrace. At another, her wan grin at her nephew's birthday celebration remains as both a dreary contradiction to the debilitated smile the elements casualties see before they bite the dust, in this way the film's title. As well as an engaging second for watchers who have hesitantly jumbled their direction through comparative get-togethers amidst a burdensome episode, unfortunately, in spite of a convincing lead areas of strength for and behind the camera, the variety range, in shades of lavender, pink, blue-green, and dark, is proficiently picked and very existing apart from everything else, grin, is lessened by the sheer reality that it's not as new an idea as it would appear. This is Chief Parker Finn's presentation highlight as an essayist and chief. In light of a short film that won a jury grant at South by Southwest 2020. To turn that into a non-establishment wide discharge film from a significant studio like Central in no less than two years, in a pandemic, no less. Is a great accomplishment, certainly, 
be that as it may, in cushioning out the idea from a 11 minute short into an almost two hour film, Grin inclines too vigorously on equation based secret plotting, yet in addition on repulsiveness I'm subjects and symbolism something. lifted from well known hits like The Ring and but It Follows. The worst David smile Robert Mitchell's 2014 see, film is a particularly noticeable, suppose, effect like on Grin, really which, terrible. joined with its situation on the It's Truly it About Injury that continuum. That I'm, Make this I'm gonna, a less cropping film insight than it could have right been had it here. thought outside the box all the more forcefully. It presents him as a skilled guest in his box, one with an ability for a richly created bounce alarm and a talent for causing a watcher to feel uncomfortable and irritated as they leave the theater it's for a film like this one. Yet, fans eager to see an unique blood about? and gore movie hitting theaters ought to treat those assumptions. Hi.